Hello everybody, in this video, I'm going to explain you the exercise 10 point 100. To increase the lifetime 1.5 times 10 to the power of minus 5 mol of xenon is placed in an often 500 milliliter incandescent light bulb to minimize the rate of evaporation of the tungsten filament. So, what's the pressure of xenon in the light bulb at 25 degree? As the question given, we have the amount of substance here which is equal to 1.5 multiplied by 10 to the power of minus 5 mol. Then we have the volume, which is 500 milliliter. But in this question, it has to be converted to rubic meter. So it's equal to 0.5 multiplied by 10 to the power of minus 3 rubic meter. Then we have the temperature, which is equal to 25 degree, and is equal to 298.15 Kelvin. So here we have the gas constant of xenon, which is equal to 8.314 joule per Kelvin mole. Here is the calculation. The formula that I used is P is equal to the product of N, R, and T over the volume. So as you can see, P is equal to 1.5 times 10 to the power of minus 5 mole multiplied by 8.314 joule per Kelvin mole multiplied by 298.15 Kelvin over 0.5 times 10 to the power of minus 3 rubic meter. So the answer is 74.36 joule per rubic meter. <clears throat> but the pressure has to be in Pascal. So here is the unit conversion. 1 joule is equal to 1 newton multiplied by 1 meter and is equal to 1 kilogram multiplied by the square of meter over the square of second. In Pascal, is equal to 1 newton over the square of meter, which is also kilogram over the square of second multiplied by 1 meter. So as you can see here, 1 pascal is equal to 1 joule per rubic meter. So the pressure is equal to 74.36 pascal. That's it. Thank you for your time.